you welcome to Geekism and welcome to the end of the level. Thanks for watching. See you next week. <laughs> right, so I've just loaded the game back up again because uh, this is technically episode four, even though you'll never see three because I was a moron who didn't record the video um, and just had uh, half an hour of me talking to myself. But I'll show you quickly um, what we did. So it, not much happened, actually. We had some issues with staffing. Um, so most of the most of the game, most of the episode was fixing staff in, but we did end up putting in a second platform and doing it pretty simply, pretty basically, really. I, I original plan. Uh, oh, I can get rid of this now. I had, had a weird moment where there was a pair of feet stuck in there, but nobody else. Okay, so um, the original plan was to come down here with a second ticket entrance price and then over here, but um, I decided in the end just to keep it simple and just and come down here and just have this this. Uh, opening here as, as for both platforms and that's all I had to do in this one was get that second platform set up and uh, otherwise it's fine we have to spread out here to provide some more fuel uh, that was quite um, uh, that can needed quite a lot uh, and then basically I let it play so that we can unlock some more procurement stuff because what I would like to do I think is go back to some of the early levels and stick in the second platforms to all of those uh, and basically get those completed off so I'm just going to unlock all the uh, the other few bits here that we can do. There isn't loads, uh, but I'll get whatever we can, um, just so it's oh, so it's done basically. Any commerce, uh, cash machine, drinks machine. Unlock lower tech first. Okay, available bonds cannot afford. But oh, okay, we don't have enough for that. Well, that's fine. We'll get the phone box ad then at least. Uh, but we do need that because there's people complaining about not having enough places to spend uh, money, which is a bit weird, I guess. Uh, but then in amenities, I think I was a medicine cabinet there. What's that one for? Uh, staff can use it when they're injured. Okay. Uh, but otherwise, I, I guess that's okay. Commerce. Uh, facilities we unlocked a bus get that be quite cool level two plant so what i'm going to do is um we're going to complete challenge there we go we'll get that little screen pop up and then go to the map and then that saves that as being completed now and it will start to open up some level zone fours and threes uh, but what i want to do actually is come back to a zone five rather than just pushing forward and and probably not uh, you know and uh, probably failing <laughs> i want to head back to our original one here and see if um, if now with all of that extra stuff, we can make this place superb, um, and I'm pretty sure it will be as is. Yeah. So uh, this station has been awarded two stars. So tracks built one of two doors um, awarded football bonus one of two. No, you may need to come back with more tech unlocks to build all of the tracks. Uh, we've got a relatively rep uh, reputation change. That's fine. Um, finances are fine. City Hall targets uh, optional goals. That's ninety four. So I'm going to click play on, right? And now we can let's have a look. We can keep uh, the reputation above zero. That if it goes under zero, it's the end of the game. So reputation of seventy five, reputation of a hundred. That seems a bit ridiculous. Uh, train targets on all possible entrances. Uh, build number of tracks maximum. So basically, a second track there. And, I, and I'm assuming there's a second entrance somewhere. Oh, here. Okay. So I am tempted. I am tempted to completely wipe this place out and start over. Right? Because what we could do is have a basically like a pretty decent sized concourse here that opens up entrance and exits and then... And then just have the two platforms here with with stairs over this first one, but have both entrances come into a shopping plaza, um, big old ticket booth in and out. And I think probably completely redoing it is a better way to go. So if I click close there, and kind will everyone clear out? You have met the current goals. Click to end station. Oh no, I don't want to do that. There is no route from platform one to exit. Oh. Right, that literally just closes the door. That's no good. So basically what we have to do is let this get to the end of the day. <laughs> um, can we at least maybe make that a better train? Yeah. There we go. So, because we didn't have that as a good train. This was the very first one we did. So we had basic train, two platforms. Basically what I need to do is run this to the end of the day. And then we can get the staff off shift. And we can uh, completely clear it out and start over again. Okay, it's night time. So what we're going to do is get everything all cleaned out. Um, who's got the litter picker? You. So you can enter that bin, please. 
Um, no, is it empty that actually? Thank you. What was really bad? Litter. Yeah, we had a big old pile of litter here that, that didn't go for the day. So we should be able to get rid of you now. Are you empty as well? Nice. Uh, okay. So, yeah, what I think we're going to do is is take everyone off shift. I don't know whether this is the right thing to do or not, but I'm going to I'm gonna go to... Oh, uh, where are we? Schedule, thresholds, uniforms, off shift. Do I have to do it all individually? There we go. Off shift. Bye-bye. Head up back to the Starship Enterprise. Okay. And then here we go. I don't know whether this is a good idea or not, but let's try. Because we've got we've got crappy um benches, we've got crappy plants. We can't get rid of that uh wheelie bin, so that's fine. And we've got the big things of those there. There's the light. Uh, there's a plant there, look. Okay, oh, that thing. I'm hoping that smoke goes away. No, it's being insistent. Well, the floor's going away now, so. Uh, sell the track. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can buy track back. Sell the entrance. That'll stop people coming in full stop. Uh, okay, so now we can go to floor. And can I get rid of... So I can't get rid of floor that way. I've got to get rid of the room first. So, staff room. Can I not? How do I get rid of the room? Do I click sell? So the answer is no. I can't. I just can't fix that. <laughs> it just does not want to happen. The door is going to be there forever as a door to nowhere. So this, this room we can work with. That's not a problem. Uh, so we've got a door, the entrance there, entrance there. So what I'm thinking actually, because of this really awkward little block that we, there's nothing you can do about it, that's just part of the uh, the challenge, so to speak. Um, I'm wondering if we actually do have, um, if we do go for sort of two separate areas, whereas, so here we just have, um, we have down to this track, I don't know whether we can do this. If we come down to this track here, right? And then do that just so we can increase the length of the trains eventually. And then here we do the same again down to here. But I'm, I'm pretty sure that if we do that and then try and put a station in, a platform in, uh, track has a gap, all collides with existing concourse or rooms. Yes, that's the thing. That's why it's going to be tricky, isn't it? So we could do this, and that will just put, um, yeah, that'll just put the whole track in there, and then we'll just have to have some get stairs over it, I suppose. Okay. So, is it then? I mean, we're going to have to, right? We're going to have to. So what we'll do is we'll get rid of this. There's no point in having uh, two runways down here, right? We might as well just do it here. And then this is your big old, this is your big old open area, right? So we'll go two there, two there, just to open it all up. And then we'll do the same there, two there, two there. And then all we need is at some point here, well, we could do two of them actually, couldn't we? So we can do one and uh two just to kind of help people out and I, I think that will be okay so maybe um maybe we can do something like this just to kind of keep it a little interesting um we can put some chairs back there and some seats there that that, that, that might look cool and um or some chairs there and some posters here or something i don't know just thinking what could look a bit different. Yeah, I quite like that, actually. Um, so we can have, like, tickets over here. There's two places you can buy tickets. You can buy tickets there and you can buy tickets over here. So what I might do, actually, then, is bring that to here and have this as one of the rooms. Um, and I might just take this back a little here for tickets there. So, tick so you could come in, tickets, onto the concourse, come in, tickets, maybe some stores and stuff here. 
and then through. I think that's how we're going to try and do it. I don't know whether that's going to be any good, but we'll try. We've got seven grand, and that's going to cost us 900. So I think actually we might just have to be able to get the one set up. Uh, I don't know whether we're going to be able to afford both. So we'll just do one for now and see how we get on. I mean, ridiculous not to have level two turnstiles. So let's go for... Um, let's go from there. And we'll do one, two, three... Let's do one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, okay. Now, I I realize at this point that that is lopsided, but I'm going to use this as a PA system so people come through here a bit quicker, right? Because we want to get people shunting, right? That's going to be the, the main point here. So we're not going to bother with platform two. Even though it's there, we're going we're gonna to try and start without it. Um, but what we do need is some... Uh, ticket machines and they're gonna have to be really on both sides so we'll say tickets 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 please and then here tickets and tickets probably a little overkill but it's done level two bent bent blah, 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 level two bins they look pretty sweet can't put one there because there's an invisible door that we're never gonna need uh okay oh that's the thing we need another room as well we suppose we could have a room down here uh staff room can be relatively out of the way right so this one here for the power can pretty much fill this space. Uh, this one can be tools, which I feel should be big enough. And then we can have a little staff room down here. Okay, let's do that. So trash then. Let's see, here's a good spot for trash. And here's a good spot for trash. For now, I'll leave it at those two. Maps, they're very important. Um, we'll get a level one map. We'll do one by the tickets this side. We'll do one by the tickets this side. We'll do one on this side of the platform. And then we'll eventually have some further ones down as well. Nice enough bench. Um, I mean, I, they always moan for benches over here, but I don't really want them to sit down over here, really. It should be all about getting in and out. How are we doing for money? Two, three. Yeah, we should be okay to get this first one set up, I think. So we'll do one, two, three there. Uh, okay, so in, out. Um, oh, toilets. They're new. Um yeah, we should probably... Toilets is probably not a bad idea. All right, well, let's do some... Did they, were they too wide? Too wide. So let's do here. One, two, three. We can do three toilets along there. Uh, we could even do two toilets on this side as well. Now, I don't know whether that's too many or not. They're 400. So maybe we just put one either side for now. Oh yeah, one, two. Okay, so one, there we go. So maybe we just put one either side for now, see how we get on, because we have no power. I've just realized, ouch, we may struggle here. Well, I'll tell you what then. Um, let us manage on one ticket either side. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll, we'll, we'll go right back. <laughs> I know this kind of defeats the whole purpose of what we were doing, but if we go right back to here... But we have the prep for it now, right? We we know where the second platform's going to be. We know what's going to work. And honestly, we could, that's two and a half grand that we just don't need to spend right now either. So, okay, let's go back to there. Um, what we will do is bring this down here into a, a staff room there. Okay. So, because we haven't even got any of the rooms really yet. So, staff room. No? Can, is that not good enough? Yeah, there we go. Now, multiple doors would be nice, but I don't think it's going to let us do that. No, so we have that door on that side. Uh, yeah, that's kind of out the way, right? Um, control room might be nice, actually. Tool room, I definitely think we need a tool room. So we did say we were going to make this here, uh, the tool room space. So I, I'm not worried about that one spot there. Let's do, yeah, let's do that. And then that can be our tool room. Uh, entrances that would be a really good spot for the entrance actually but maybe maybe there where we weren't oh no we were, we're gonna have a second bathroom there weren't we hmm let's try that again remember to delete rooms properly this time tool room let's go yeah that's gonna be a bathroom there so I guess it's I guess the entrance is here for the tools okay uh, utility room we can uh, we can probably extend out 
that way at least. I realize it's going to get rid of a lot of the work we've already done, but that's okay. And that way a little. All right. Because the utility room got to be pretty big um, because it's, it's going to take all of that power. It's going to have all of the power things in there. I do believe we have level two... Um, level two generators now we don't have level two generators oh when are we going to get those uh level two generator and available in next zone oh that's a bit of a killer that because that means we we're going to be a little struggling on capacity here but okay so first of all then we can get rid of that we don't need that with the entrance being this side but again scope for the future is there uh, we've got some benches there. I feel like we probably need some benches on this side as well. What I might do is just make this tool room um, No, there's no need for that to be bigger is there? I, I know we've got a bit of a, a Bit of a choke here now, but then people aren't really gonna come down here The only people are coming down here are staff that are chilling out or people who are coming up so Actually, I think we'll leave it like that. All right, entrance. We definitely need one of those. Boom. Okay. Um, so staff only zone. We haven't got to worry about that just now. Uh, footbridge. We haven't got to worry about that. Staircases. No. Uh, tool room. We have utility room. We have staff room. We have control room. Would be nice. Um, the obvious spot for it would be there. Um, and what I'm going to do is put. I'm going to put it in with a view. Um, to use it later, but probably won't be using it to like quickly Cannot build rooms on objects. How's that then? Okay, can we just make it like that? Yeah, there we go. Just got that one little staff door there. That's just completely stuck uh, Okay facilities then let's just check. We've got all this lighting is something we need. So let's get some Let's go as far as we can this way so we can do one there and we could probably get away with one there for now. A little bit of crossover, that's fine. And then we should be able to do one there. And one there. Pretty much covers everywhere. That's fine by me. Turnstiles are done. Uh, ticket machines are done. We've got some trash cans. We need some... Oh, we did have maps, but now we lost maps because of the work we did here. So let's see if we can find... I really don't... That annoys me a little that they kind of hang out off the wall there. I hope that's a little bug that can be fixed. So we have a map there. We also had a map over here and that's gone. So we'll put another one down there. Benches. We probably need a few more benches here. Let's do just two on the end there. That could be cool. Uh, toilets. We've got a few of those. Level two plants. Let's have. Oh, they're nice. They're like a... They're like a little, um, uh, like a proper planter. That's pretty cool. So I'm going to put one of those. Um, I want a PA system there and there to really help get the people through. So we'll say plant there. Oh, I like it a lot. That's cool. Um, and probably somewhere else would be a nice spot for a plant. Uh, I haven't really got any spots that are really suitable. Maybe we'll just have that one for now. Is that ridiculous? And a busker. I love the idea of a busker. We've got to get a busker dude in here. That's the exact sort of spot he would be. Nice. Okay. So, fuel barrel. Let's go for uh, two, fu two fuel barrels. We are not going to be able to afford the generators this thing is going to need at all here. These are like 300 each. Um, one, two, three... I can't even afford four generators. Okay, man, tight. money is tight here at the beginning. We'll lose a ticket machine. We'll lose a... We'll lose that bathroom. Uh, and let's go back. So we need at least four generators. At least. And I'm going to put two wheelie bins down just because that kind of seems to be sensible. Signal relay we can afford, but I won't because we need staff. Um... Level one PA. How much of those? That's the first thing we'll buy. Is level one PA. We've just we've got nothing. We haven't got any tools. Oh, um, do we get rid of the bathroom for now then and put it in when we can? I just feel like we've overspent and now we've got to go. We've got to ease right back. I suppose we could actually get rid of. Um, we could get rid of one of those. Maybe we'll just get rid of the one and put a fence in instead. That's got to be cheaper, right? Yeah, fences are 25. That's cool. That gives us 800 to play with. So, 
Um, let's make sure we've got some basic for the staff. Uh, two chairs and something to eat and drink. That That's like bare minimum. Leaves us with 216. Okay. Um, right, we're going to go for one fuel barrel, one wheelie bin. It doesn't give us that much, does it? Uh, there's very little else we can get rid of here. We don't need that room, to be honest. Let's get rid of that. And, and, and that means we can get rid of all of that as well. Oops. Four sixty. Floor man is expensive in this game. Let's give us a grand to play with lot now. Okay. So tools we're desperate for. Let's think about this. What I would like to try and do is put our staff into groups this time. So have a cleaner, have an engineer, etc. So I'm gonna put a, a litter picker. Um yeah, litter picker, mop, and rat catcher. And that's gonna be one person's job, right? Then we can have the toolkit and jerry can as another person's job. They are going to be engineer, whatever. And then the third one, I guess, is uh, like customer relations. So at the moment, that's that's mostly health, and we do have a plant. We don't have enough money to, to look after the plants. Okay, well, that's fine. Ho hopefully the plant doesn't look too bad and we can get a water thing in there pretty soon. So we can now bring all of our staff on shift. Let's have a look how many... Does it tell me how many spaces they have? Because what we can do, I think... There's a way we can give them specific tools. So I'm going to say on shift for all of them. They can all have their regular breaks. And then... And we get uniforms as well, I think. Can we? Can, is that something we can do? Building lockers makes different uniforms available. Each uniform will boost a different. So I don't, I don't believe we have those yet. Amenities is that amenities lockers? Yeah. So like refuse locker, technician locker, medic locker. There we go. So we're, we're that's definitely some a way we're going to go forward. But even without the staff, uh, why have we only got two members of staff? Oh, they're all there. Okay, okay. Time break. You can have your break. That's cool. Are you going to get? Rest up, or you're going to go down there. All right. So it looked like there were a few people there who were able to do multiple jobs. Um, is it Rodriguez level up available? Okay, nice. So strength, I think, allows them to carry more stuff. Um, speed, perception makes their thingy wider. Stamina means how fast they will recover. That seems like a good thing to do. So we'll level up. Uh, who else has one of those? Is it Rodriguez? Roberts. Okay, you've got pretty good stamina already. I'm going to do your strength and see if it gives you a third window. No, not quite. So, White, you are uh, you're the only person with three tools, so you are now our cleaner. I'm sure there's a way we can do it. Let's have a look. Uh, job priorities. Is it that one there? Staff AI. When on, staff automatically equip tools and do jobs. When off, staff automatically do jobs, but you must equip the tools manually. Okay, so... Uh, priority one slot. Uh, how do we how do we do that then? Can we click like that? Litter picker. So get the litter picker. Get the get the mop. And get the and get the rat catcher. Um, so file, so job priorities, there we go, so now does that classes, there we go, staff, enable staff AI and staff to manage, ah, okay, so, so this system is for automated response, this is if you want to make the guy, uh, uh, uh whatever, so, litter picking, then mop, then rats, so rats really should be number one, if there are rats here, boom, get on them. After that, it's a mop's important because that can knock people out. After that, you do the regular litter. Okay, that's good. That's um, that's Mr. White sorted. So, next up, we'll do Rodriguez. I don't believe like it really matters regarding these two. So, I'm going to say Rodriguez can be a, a health and fitness lady. Getting first aid. We should be open here and we're not. Um, okay, so let's say you're a lit You're a litted. You're a litted? So you are all going to platform one. You are going to the exit. 
computing flow checker. I think you should be good to go now, flow checker. Are we are we still are we using too much power still? Wow, yeah, look at that. Uh, we're making five and we need six. And we can't afford any more generators. So what can we do that will save us some electricity? See you, Busker. You're out of here. Uh, and you know what? We'll lose one of you as well. That should power-wise be okay. Okay, power-wise, that's acceptable. So let's just put a fence in there so that people can't get through without uh, doing what they need to. Okay, so white's on the rat prod. That's good. Uh, you need to pick up that drip. There we go. So you're fine, Rodriguez. And then Roberts, you need to come and grab the toolkit as a priority. Oh, we need to open. <laughs> surely, surely there's enough power now. Now we got rid of all that stuff. 5.85, max capacity 5. Jeez, man, what is going on? Okay. The only other thing we can do here is go delete, 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 and just and remove that bit for now. Right. What is there? Oh, a light. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> that will help with electricity as well. But <laughs> there we go. That's given us enough money. So it's brought the electricity down a little, and we could probably get in a second generator now. We've got another two in. Cool. We will do. Does that mean we can get our busker back? I really want the busker to be here. Uh, utilities, is it? Level one. No. It's facilities. Busker. Come on, dude. Play your heart out, kiddo. Should we put you to where people can hear you a bit more? There you go. You can go there. <laughs> right. I feel like power-wise, we've got to be fine now. Okay. Yeah, there we go. All right. So that's that. Um, what do you want? Newspaper? You can wait. Uh, Miss Roberts, please come and get a toolkit. All right, let's bring that train in. There we go. We've got a train. It's quarter past nine in the morning. We have our first train coming in. Miss Roberts, go and grab your jerry can. And then Miss Roberts will set your flag to there. Mr. White, we will also set your flag to there. And Mrs. Rodriguez, we will send your flag to there. Okay, and after that, you are free to go on your break, Miss Roberts. Thank you very much. <sighs> Wow, that was a really backwards episode. We built something and then got rid of it and then built it again and got rid of it and built it again. So hold on, cash machine. Oh, I thought she was saying she hadn't got a ticket. There's a bat. There's literally a map there, dude. If you lost, he's gonna go and find it there. Good job. Right, and we've got some money coming in. So can we remember <laughs> what the uh, the few things we wanted to add in were once we could afford it? I mean, first thing should probably just be more power. Because we just have not got the cash for it. We have zero adverts as well. That's definitely something we need to look at because they just earn money, right? More seats. Why do you want more seats? There is a seat there that is empty. Go and sit on it. Chris machine. Yeah, okay. I'm fine with like way of selling, way of buying things. That's no problem. So let's get a Chris machine and a drinks machine here. Crisp and drinks. We can't afford it. We've got a drinks machine. Cash machine? No, you can wait. As soon as we've got the money crisps going in, because then we've got at least something they can spend their cash on, right? I'm going to speed the game up a little as well. Apologies if this ends up being another long one. <laughs> Bought soft drinks, good. As you should. Right, money's coming in. There we go. Are you are you just bleeding? Or was that Coke that you just dropped? Boop, 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 Okay, there we go. We have food and drink. Why are you wearing an umbrella? On strike? Have we not got enough money to pay you? Yep, sounds a bit right. Um, hit transit targets on all possible entrances. We get a grand for that. Loans. Are, oh, crap. Train. Uh, loans would be nice in this game. I would totally take a little loan now. I don't think it's a thing, is it? Reports. 
Computers. Commerce. Oh, here we go. Look, markup. $10. Rep. Why are we losing rep? Is this, are the tickets expensive? I suppose we could knock them down a dollar. Like, it makes people happy. It's pretty much profit on those anyway, I think. Here we go. Get on your train. Good, good, good. Uh, okay, we have seven. I don't think there's anything waiting to unlock now with our bonds. I think we're going to take our bonds to the next level. To the next level. To the max. Yeah, everything is... Everything is pretty much locked. Okay, music's playing. I think that means we're getting better. <laughs> We've got 620 to spend. All right, so let's have a look. Reports, first of all. Power. Okay, yeah, so we need a bit of power. Uh, rep. What are people not happy about? Bad shopping range is definitely the problem and high prices. Okay, well, I've knocked the ticket price down a dollar. Can we, can we adjust the price of these? Oh, yeah, look at that. Drinks machine. So they, the tickets cost us nothing. So we could even knock them down to eight and keep people happy. We can make those seven. We can make the water five. We can make the crisps. Five pounds for a pack of crisps. I mean, the underground is expensive, but geez. Uh, okay, so that's prices fixed a little there, right? Uh, and then we need more shopping experiences and there's no toilet and it's gloomy. Okay, I thought the whole place was pretty lit up. I suppose this area is a little dark now because there was a light down here, right? That was probably covering that. Um, so toilets and shopping, it seems to be the things that are causing people the most issues. So let's pop a toilet in. Uh, toilets. And we'll go there. That's fine. We can afford one toilet. There we go. Another ticket machine would be handy. Might have to move that busker tonight and put another ticket machine in because there's a bit of a queue there. Yeah, they're all buying them though. They all seem to be happy about it. Uh, and more shopping. So the other shopping, I suppose, we've got drinks, we've got crisps, newspaper stand, I guess. Uh, is that a good spot for a newspaper stand there? Oh, I'll tell you what. Let's just open that one little bit up there that's like not opened. Because that was where the uh, the toilet will sit. But we can totally put a newspaper sand there. Instead of a empty spot. There we go. Now you can buy newspapers. Oh, train. <laughs> already. <laughs> already I'm used to, uh, to having the trains automated. Okay. So let's look at... It's all about getting that rep up at the minute. Because... Um, because we're, we're low. It's low, basically. Uh, journey complete, good. Staff action, refuse, nice. Staff action, mechanic. Prestige, medium plant, good. Busker. Uh, toilet available, rest, bench. Retail, bargain, nice. Bin access, bad shopping range and high prices. Should should hopefully slow down. The problem is that the 59 that felt that don't go away. The only way this number goes down is for the, is for the number of people who don't think that to go up, if that makes sense, you know. Uh, are our staff all back to normal now? Yeah. Do I risk skipping to dawn? Rodriguez, how are you feeling? Your health is at 100. Your despair is slowly going down. Maybe something for our, our staff then. After them working so hard. Oh, you, you, you're off your auto rest. That's good. Uh, helping to increase their happiness. Is there a despair thing? I, I guess TV is probably a good thing to do. It requires a bit of power, I think. So talking of which, do we how are we doing with power? Is that something we're going to have to work on? Let's have a look. Uh, I mean, a lot of this isn't being used right now. Maybe we'll skip to dawn. Uh, who's asking for watering can? Need more tools, Rodriguez. Watering can. Okay. Now the problem with that is Rodriguez uh, is I'm, nobody's going to be able to hold it. Now there were wasn't there another member of staff we could hire? Oh, nice. Here we go. Uh, da, 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 da. not enough money to hire. We are totally going to take one of you on and make you uh, customer relations and get you um, watering plants. And oh god, the plant is dead. The plant is so dead. Okay, as soon as we've got cash, oh, the whole plant's gone. All right, nice. Never mind. <laughs> Literally picked the whole thing up. I would love to hear the. I would love to hear the busker. 
Nice toilet. Nice toilet. I always think that, you know, walking through it. I've never thought that, actually, on an underground. I've never walked in a train station and thought, nice toilet. I've always thought, I'll hold it. I'm not using that. <laughs> right. There we go. I feel like we're on a good run for... I just Sorry, we haven't really progressed. I mean, genuinely, all we've done is rebuilt this station. That's it. Like, I think... Um, but hopefully you can understand where I'm coming from. I want to make sure I've got the fundamentals down before I move into the higher level ones where people are coming in fighting and all that kind of stuff, you know. Uh, I hope you've still enjoyed it, even though we haven't made much progress. I have. I'm loving this at the moment. I'm having a whale of a time in Overcrowd. Uh, thanks for watching. Love you all to bits. Until the next one, be good.